Congress, the labor is in the house here. Thousands of retirees converged on the Capitol's West Lawn to hear support of members of Congress and union members who are fighting to protect pensions. The IAM will stand with you every step of the way to make sure you get every dime of the pension you paid for, the insurance for the pension you paid for. It's ours and we're not going to let anybody take it away. IAM General Vice President Jim Canigliaro told the crowd that as Americans, we have to come together to avoid the crisis that would be created if the Treasury Department approves the central state's pension fund application to cut benefits. We know that pensions are not just a promise. Pension was an obligation from companies to take care of their employees, and it's the difference between living with dignity or struggling with poverty. This is a travesty of justice. We can't let this happen. One by one, each speaker pledged support. People who work hard for a lifetime to build their future for themselves and their families should never have to doubt retirement security. When you work and play by the rules, the government shouldn't throw you under the trucks you drive. That's our message. A majority of people who serve here didn't keep their promise to you. They didn't keep their promise to you. There are things that this body can do uh, to, to, to create an opportunity for you to get what you deserve. This is not a gift. This is not some kind of giving. You earned it. You worked for it. You deserve it. We are going to fight to pass the Keep Our Pensions Promises Act. It would restore pension protections for retirees and strengthen the multi-employer pension plan. And we will continue to fight this thing until we get you the money that you deserve. The Treasury Department is expected to make its decision on whether to cut retirees' pension benefits within a month. Tanya Hutchins, Machinist News Network.